Hello, it's Morgan from The Metal Company here. On today's Technical Tuesday, I'll be discussing how to calculate a flange PCD when it's difficult to access the flange. Based on the number of holes in the flange, you can multiply the distance between the holes by a specific factor to estimate the PCD. Here are the factors for different numbers of holes. For four holes, multiply the distance between two adjacent holes by 1.414. For eight holes, multiply it by 2.613. For 12 holes, multiply it by 3.864. For 16 holes, multiply it by 5.126. For example, let's say you have a flange with eight holes and a measurement of 90 millimeters between two adjacent holes. To calculate the PCD, you would multiply 90 by 2.613, which gives you 235 millimetres. These calculations are readily available on the technical section of our website under the flange category, so you can find them anytime you need. Using the calculated PCD and the internal measurement of the flange, you can refer to our flange identification chart to determine the flange type which suggests this flange is a table D or table E flange. Keep in mind that this method provides an estimation of the PCD and may not be as accurate as directly measuring it. I hope this has been helpful in estimating which flange you have. If you have any further questions, reach out to the crew at The Metal Company because we make buying stainless steel easy.